YouTube and welcome to part 5 of how to design, develop and manufacture a printed circuit board. This is a UV light box which we're going to use to expose the printed circuit board. So first off I place the acetate onto the UV light box ensuring that I can't read the writing which I put on the acetate. Then we peel this black film off the board which can be proved to be quite difficult if you haven't got any fingernails okay. and then we place the board onto the acetate ensuring that we can't see any of the black artwork close the lid check that it's plugged in and the power's on and then it's also switched on and we set it to two minutes. Once the board has been exposed to UV light for two minutes the photo coating that's destroyed will be stripped off when we put it in the developer solution. So I'm going to pause the video there and when we're done we'll look at the developing of it. This is a tri-tank which has a developing tank, a wash tank in the middle and an etch tank. Obviously safety is very important, hence why I'm wearing this ridiculous overall and these goggles. So the first thing we need to do is develop the board. So we lift this basket out, we chuck the board in and then we dip it in the developing solution. The time it takes to develop varies depending on how old the solution is and how much it's been used. So what I'm looking for is the artwork to become more clear on the circuit board. So I'm going to pause the video now and then I'll show you when it's complete. So now the developing is finished, I'm going to wash it in the wash tank. carefully take the PCB out and if I hold this up to the camera for you you can see the artwork has now been transferred onto the copper board so the pinkish colour is the exposed copper and the slightly greenish colour is the uh, bits that are protected by the etch resist so now what I'm going to do is put it into the etch tank Again, it depends on how old the solution is and how exhausted it is as to how long it takes to etch. But you should see an instant change in the colour of the board if I just wash it again. Take it out. You'll notice it's gone a lot pinker on the board. So, again, I'm going to pause the video in a second and we'll have a look at the board when it's part way through etching. So we'll press the pump. This has got an aerator in it and it's also heated which speeds up the etching time.